Hello everyone and welcome back to another GTA Online gun running DLC update video where today we've got a whole bunch of new images for the upcoming release of the DLC so let's take a look at them all. So in this first one there's not too much going on, there's only a Hydra being blown up by a new vehicle. Well it's not really a vehicle, it's more of a towable kind of trailer kind of thing with the SAM missile going on. The guy operating the SAM missile is uh, wearing some pretty snazzy new camouflage clothing as well as a nice new hat. I don't think that's been uh, in the game but uh, we've also got a new camouflage on this trailer thing we've got a kind of blue urban camo thing going on so yeah there's that one there's not really too much going on here so let's just move on to the next one now this one is probably the most interesting image that we currently have it's basically this huge red truck which is carrying some kind of mobile storage facility thing maybe they're transporting some tank or something who knows maybe you have to build a uh, hardware and then sell it onwards kind of like with the car import export business but yeah what we also have is just a whole bunch of new camouflages to show off we've got kind of like a desert bright uh, choco chip camouflage if we look right at the back we've also got a new unique camouflage there that we haven't seen before I can't quite tell what it is it might be that half track that we saw in the previous video but uh, yeah we can't really get too much clarity on it let's see if I can get a close up on it Mmm, yes. Ooh, it, it kind of looks like a flat cannon, something that's designed for shooting down aircraft. Like, it, it fires big, massive shells instead of, like, firing missiles. So, yeah, if we look to the car to the left, you'll see that there's a driver spot and there's also a passenger spot, but the passenger gets a front-mounted machine gun, which is pretty cool. That'll be an amazing car for chasing people down. So this will be a pretty scary car to have behind you, to say the least. So anyways, uh, moving on to the truck here, we can, if we look really carefully on the top of it, you can see that there's actually a machine gun or some kind of gun mounted on top. I can't really tell what it is. Maybe it's operated by someone who's inside the cabin on the back. Who knows? Maybe you have to have a whole bunch of people like operating, I don't know. Maybe instead of being a, uh, a storage unit, it could be a weapons platform. Like there could be missiles poking out the top of it and it, who knows. We can only really speculate with this angle picture thing going on. So yeah, apart from that, we've got a couple of vehicles that we've seen before. New camouflage. This one's kind of a green. Uh, we haven't seen that before. That's pretty cool. And uh, yeah, apart from that, there's not really much going on so <laughs> yeah this is probably the most interesting picture of the bunch so let's move on to agent whatever his name is he's just known as the agent or he's got he's got a number after agent but anyways yeah so it looks like in this DLC we're going to be taking on a whole bunch of new missions kind of like heist it'd be really interesting to see what we have here like just from this picture alone we can't really tell too much of what's going on but it looks like it's been taken place inside a bunker maybe showing the player what's going on for the first time like with the other businesses you get shown around like LJT and your assistant uh, apart from that uh, looks like the character is wearing some new clothing which is pretty cool uh, let's move on to the next picture now this one's pretty interesting as well if you look all the way to the right the guy on the right with the red light machine gun that's a completely brand new gun uh, I can't really tell what it is, but uh, yeah, new camouflage and new attachments as well. Look at that, that's a red dot sight on there. Uh, moving on to the middle, we've also got a new camouflage gun. That's a very nice bright green there. Also, I should I should probably state that all of these characters are wearing brand new clothing. None of this has been seen in the game before. But if you look to the left, if you look on the sniper rifle, you'll see that there's a new kind of lens on there. Now, I wonder what that could be. It's got a bright green hue on it. So it could possibly be a thermal scope or a night vision scope. Who knows? We'll just have to see. But uh, moving on to this picture now. So if we look in the middle here, we can see a CNC machine, which is designed for scraping away metal and shaping it into something that you want. Now this is often used in the manufacturing of weapons. So also speaking of the manufacturing of weapons, if you look all the way to the left here, you can see some brand new weapons. Uh, you can't really tell what these are. Let's zoom in here. 
Yeah, that kind of looks like an MP5K, maybe? I can't really tell. Yeah, there's also a sledgehammer there, some kind of sword looking things. I can't really tell, there's not enough clarity to see really. But as you can probably imagine, this is what the businesses will look like inside your bunker. You'll just have a whole bunch of scientists doing R&D on weapons and then manufacturing and selling them. So moving on, we now have this very elaborate bike, which <laughs> which kind of reminds me of the Rocket Voltic. It's probably gonna work exactly the same way. But as you can see, it's got some wings on it. Now, I doubt it'll be able to fly but I think it'll be able to glide, so maybe... So as the picture is showing, the guy is jumping off a really high place and then using the rocket booster to <laughs> make him glide to really far areas. I can imagine this bike being a whole bunch of fun to ride around, but um, yeah, apart from that, he's got a new coat on, which is pretty darn cool. So uh, moving on, we have another shot of a vehicle that we've seen before. Not really, not too much going on here. There's, there's a new camouflage on it, but that's all really I can see. If you take a close look at the missile, you can see there's kind of a reflective looking tip to it. Now, that to me looks like a camera lens. Now, that to me looks like some kind of missile that you can control. Now, against Hydras, this will be a pretty fun toy to play with. You can just imagine like steering with your control stick or mouse to shoot down a, an aircraft really far away. That This will be really fun. Hopefully, hopefully I'm right in saying that that's a controllable missile. But anyways, moving on to the final picture. We have ourselves another shot of the buggy that we saw earlier with the machine gun. In this shot, he's actually using the machine gun and it looks like it delivers a lot of firepower. And uh, obviously we have a close look at the new camouflage, the bright choco chip kind of looking thing, as well as a few things going on in the background. So uh, yeah, that's pretty much all the pictures. Um, if there's any new pictures that get released, I'll let you know immediately as soon as I can. And uh, I hope you enjoyed this quick video, This very quick and lazy video and I will see you in the next one. See you around guys.